So how do we do it? This is um, this is all set up in Unreal. Uh, the characters were built in Character Creator 4. These characters were actually built for the Character Creator 4 competition that's going on at the moment. I think it's just we just managed to get them finished before the deadline, which was the 1st of September. And so we made this uh, monkey band. And I just wanted to show these being used live in real time. Yeah, so the characters are built in Character Creator 4. Uh, but then brought into Unreal, and then in Unreal we've connected it up to the XN Suit 4 live motion capture. And as you can see, here I am in my motion capture suit. In front of me, I have uh, my iPhone that's doing my facial capture, and the characters behind me are just on a looped animation. So we've seen, I've shown this quite a lot. Um, how to do like a live virtual real-time character talking with the iPhone and motion capture suit. But one of the things that I really want to push with all this and I think could be really big is virtual bands. Um, there's a decline in bands apparently and that's where I think virtual bands could be the next thing to fill that gap. So if you're on your own like me and you want to do a band performance, it's pretty difficult to do on your own. So that's where I've been playing around with making the sequences for that performance, pre-make them, but then trying to combine it into the, uh, the real-time stream. So basically I can be doing a stream now and obviously I'm live, chatting away, but I want to go into a pre-recorded performance. I can hit a key and do that. What I could also do as well is hit a key and make the band behind me go into a pre-recorded performance along with the music. But then I could actually sing and be be live, but I can't sing and perform, so it's, it's all pre-recorded. But I'll show you how it works. So if I just hit a key now. basically record a whole bunch of um, pre-made animations and have them set to so, you know, the triggers as well we can make them a little bit more seamless so as I've done in my, old, my old, a previous video I could hit an invisible key or a box or a trigger or something that will make that animation kind of kick in so yeah basically that that's what I wanted to show um, if anyone's got any questions, I'm happy to answer, but I just really wanted to um, show off the whole kind of being able to trigger things and just a way that you can make a virtual band uh, and control it and run it in a simple way. Uh, there's a lot more you could do as well. Like I said earlier, you could trigger all these characters to do specific things. You could have somebody else sat here with a controller and be running lights and... Uh, environment changes uh, we could even have other characters kind of like you could hit a key and characters are running at a stage it's just it comes down to um, imagination whatever you can think of you can pretty much do uh, and it's just thinking of cool things to do with it okay so I'm gonna leave now and I might as well play through the song one more time
your feet.